purpose of this screencast is to demonstrate how to create a quiz using Hot Potatoes. Hot Potatoes is a program that allows you to create quiz questions outside of Moodle and then import those questions into Moodle provided that your Moodle administrator has the Hot Potatoes module enabled on the Moodle website. Up until this point, the Hot Potatoes module has been disabled from eLearn, but I've recently enabled it thinking that we might want to explore the options. I like to demonstrate how to create a matching question using Hot Potatoes, although there are many types of questions that you can create. First you'll need to download Hot Potatoes. If you simply do a Google search, you'll be able to find the Hot Potatoes website. Just search for Hot Potatoes Quiz and you can download it there. If you're not able to locate it, I've provided the URL on the handout that you've been given. I'm going to click JMatch and show you how to create a matching question. Let's give our question a title. For example, Theorist. And I'm going to put the names of several psychologists on the left. And then on the right I'm going to put the matching answer. The ones on the right are the ones that will end up being jumbled once the quiz is imported. It's important that you put the exact match on the right to the word on the left when you're creating the question. And then you'll save it. For now, I'm just going to save this to my desktop, and I'll just name it Theorist. Okay, now I'm going to enter my course. The first thing I want to do is click Files under the Administration block, because I want to now put the file that I just created in the Hot Potatoes program into my file folder in my course. So I'll click Upload a File, and I'll click Theorist. You might want to create a folder just for Hot Potatoes quizzes. This is just a sample course that I use to explore things in and play around in, so I'm not very organized with it yet. But as long as you have it somewhere in your Files folder, that'll suffice. And then go back to the course website. And then make sure your editing is turned on, and then click Add an Activity in the block you wish, you wish to place the quiz. So if I want to give a quiz in week 7, I'll click Add an Activity, and you may not have seen this before, but Hot Potatoes Quiz is now an option. As for what I want to name the quiz, I can just name it my file name, which is Theorist. But if I want to name it something different, I can just go to specific text and type the text in that I want to name it. File location is course files. We just put it in the course files folder. File name, let's choose our file now. I'm not going to mess with any of these settings, but they're pretty much the same as the regular quiz module that you've been using. If you have any questions about any of these options, you can refer to the quiz options handout that I've given you. So I'll save and return to course. Now I can see in week 7 I have my theorist quiz. And now the student will match the words on the right to the words on the left. And actually they can just drag them, which is kind of surprising considering kind of finicky though, considering there's no drag and drop feature in Moodle anywhere else. And then click check, and I can see that I got 100%. And now, if I go into the grade book, I can see that for Theorist, a grade of 100 automatically went into the grade book for me. So it's pretty handy. 
It allows you to create creative quizzes, do more than you would with a regular quiz module, and it kind of just makes them a little more interactive. So feel free to explore it. If you have any questions, let me know. Thank you for watching.